Hey guys, James and Jenny here. Today we're going to show you how to tile your kitchen in your camper van with Tic Tac tiles. We bought these gray ones with the white grout and um, we did it on our last van, look sweet. We're going to do it again on our um, new ProMaster. So we started our kitchen with just some 3 8 inch ply. We just attached it right onto the ribs of the van and then we also had to prep our electrical units. So we've got them all set. All right, so we're just going through the instructions here again. And uh, it says to do a light sand. So we're just doing a light sand. I don't know if you can hear me at all because Jenny's just screaming over there. We think it makes the most sense to start the tiling on this edge since it's going to be like a really clean edge. So we're going to start from this side and work our way over. James is just cutting with an X-Acto knife um, and his ruler to make this our first straight edge. Most people don't know this, but the number of likes we get is directly correlated with whether or not Jenny gets a birthday party this year. Make sure you hit the like button because if we get a thousand likes, then Jenny gets a birthday party this year. But if we get under a thousand likes, Jenny doesn't get a birthday party this year. So since we wanted to start with this being a nice clean edge, um, we actually had to flip these around. Um, as you can see, they're upside down, just because you need this white part to overlap with the next one coming in. So just keep that in mind. Also, we have been using um, a super glue along the edges, just in case it does come unstuck because the van does go through cold and hot temperatures. So it's not, you know, just like a house. So we have been adding super glue just in case. When we were applying these, you can see we had Jenny holding the corners really tight while I slowly stuck one corner down. And then we were just really meticulous and slow, making sure that we didn't leave any bubbles when we were sticking the sticker down. That's super important so that you have a really clean and polished look at the end. So we messed up on our very first tile by cutting off the wrong edge. So we had to crack open our third pack, but that's why I have an emergency pack. Always get more than you need. Return later. Yeah, or you could return it later if you don't use it. If we had planned this perfectly, we would have had this up like four more millimeters so that we didn't have to cut a skinny, skinny edge here, but it's for next time. Yeah, where it sits, the little cover plate. This is obviously not the one because we need a double, but it's just going to be, oh, there's so just going to be a couple millimeters. Ah, doing my best to measure and then measure on here. We'll have a little bit of grace because the cover plate can cover up any imperfections. That's so intense. Better than I thought it would. For my scrapbook. Trying to put the. <laughs> it's definitely not perfect. Oh god. I don't think it's gonna fit. These are kind of expensive mistakes. So. Measure twice, cut once. Measure 400 times, cut once. How much are these? It's like 40 a pack. They're like with five. 40, 50 bucks a pack. 40 divided by five, eight dollars a slice. Ooh. That's an eight dollar mistake. Can't be making those every day. All right, let's see it. Round two. Looks like it's gonna fit. All right, that got a little intense, but uh, we did it. Looks so good. Nice. Oh yeah, this thing was annoying, but in the day it looks good. And you know what? 
No mess. Didn't take too long. It's gonna flex if the walls move or anything. I'm happy with it. Sweet, so we're just fin filling in all of the last little single bits of tile. So that's our last little spot there. So we're just using some of the scraps and cutting these out, sticking them on. And uh, what else am I gonna say? I forget. All right, well, watch me put it on. Nice. Works for me. Whew, looks great. So we just finished up and we're super happy with it. We think it's a great option if you don't wanna do real tile in your van. Relatively inexpensive, it's relatively easy to apply. It is pretty tedious and we definitely needed the both of us. It's definitely a two person job. Yeah. yeah. But um, yeah, we really like it. Everyone, we had it in our last van as well and everyone thought it was real so it looks really nice. It's super polished and uh, yeah, super recommend. Yeah. My brother actually just stopped by, checked in and he thought it was real right now. So, all right, well, thanks for watching guys. See you in our next video, which is going to be, well, I don't know what it's gonna be, but you should watch it. <laughs> cool.